What's up? What's good? What's hood? And what's life? Guys, welcome back to my channel. And Leo, I will be doing you all's love reading. So what's up, players? You know, pimps, hoes, and thugs, and everything else in between. I will be doing you all's love reading. So let's see what's going on in love for Leo. Um... Well, y'all ain't hiding it no more fucking more. That's great. Look, y'all got the suppression card here in the reverse. That is an action card. So it's like y'all are no more hiding y'all feelings, y'all emotions. Y'all making some shit shake. Look at that. And the change card is here. This is a pinnacle. So you guys are really sitting. Like y'all are making some, some, some moves. Like money moves type shit and then y'all have ordinariness card here in the uh, upright so you guys are taking the simpler approach it's just like why make it so difficult like i feel like when it comes to love y'all are just like hey either you you want me or you don't like i'm not about to chase you i'm not about to doing the stalking the hateration holleration in this dance re like what it is and what we doing you know what i'm saying but you guys do have the morality card which is um thought so you guys kind of are a little traditional i'll say you guys are a little stuck in y'all ways um as far as like how y'all feel the relationship should be maybe you guys are you know very traditional in manner when it comes to thought and and just gender roles Ooh, i'll be trying to make sure the cars don't fall down the the wall but you guys have the aloneness card here in the reverse which is saying that almost you guys don't trust that you can have that like y'all can be this I won't say soft, but I guess more gentler version of yourself. Because it's like, um, Leo, cousin, fire sign. Like, hello, y'all are crazy. But it's it's like y'all are passionate more than anything than crazy. But it's like, people be trying it. People real do be trying it. And real life, they be trying it. But, um, Leo, that's not to say that you're not deserving of love. Because look, ooh, I love it. You guys got double nine and double two. So you guys got intuition and you guys have the compassion card. So, Leo, this is a sense of saying, like, follow your intuition and just move how you best see fit to move. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, this actually might could be an actual move, too. Because, look, you guys got physical activity. So I don't know if you guys are considering, like, Zumba or yoga or, like, anything that's getting your body mo moving, working out. Because, look, it is Rona. Everybody's not traveling how they would usually travel. People ain't doing what they used to be doing. Like, normally, like, we get it. Okay, it's a whole lot of ghetto activity going on in the world right now. But that's not to say that love isn't on its way and love isn't isn't accessible to you. It's just you have to change almost your thought process to it. Like, I don't know. <laughs> you guys got the parenting card here in the upright. The parenting card is talking about uh, parenting, really parenting yourself. Like, sometimes you don't have to be a bigger person. Like, if you know you had to wash dishes at your mama's house, why you ain't washing dishes at your mama's house? You know what I'm saying? If you knew you had chores at your mama's house, why you ain't got chores at your own house? You know what I'm saying? If you know that you got light skin carpet or you got bright skin carpet or white skin carpet, the fuck? You feel me? And you don't even wear your own shoes in the house. Why you gonna let your company come in and wear their shoes in your house? Because you don't want to seem like a corny person? No, that's dumb. So that's what the parenting card is. So it's like, it's the same thing with love. Like, don't don't compromise your don't settle basically is where it's getting at and then here's the creativity card so you might like want to come out of like i said that jaded way of thinking or that traditional way of thinking like you might be a millennial or not you might be a baby boomer or you might be somebody that came from generation x or z or however elemental p q r s elemental p like the fuck but saying that is to say that you know you're choosing to change your thinking look steadfastness leo you guys are staying the road ahead like don't don't get hurt or jaded by love as if you know it's just not gonna happen and it just can't come from you because look you guys got the empowerment card which is solar plexus chakra so y'all got a lot of yellow in here too so you may want to consider you know healing the inner child doing some some solar plexus meditations anything else in regards to love for leo blessings look when you grow up and boss up and floss up yeah love is definitely on its way if it's not already here but i'm saying like if you're not already happy or you're not being this best version blossoming version of yourself within this relationship it very well could be that you're just not tapped into your emotions and that's fine 
Moon and Sagittarius, our other cousin, okay? Discovery, and it says freedom and adventure. Well, you got to set yourself free of your, your own rigid way of thinking. Maybe you might have a partner that does think, you know, everything is specifically gender roles. Like, men sometimes got to be in the um, providers and protect. And then feminine energy got to be in the kitchen, cooking, cleaning, and all this other type of stuff. Like, if we're just speaking on the roles, per se. Like, whereas that might not be y'all no more. That might not. And that's fine. Then you have Eclipse in Pisces, which is free will. And it says, serve your higher purpose. And then you have the Eclipse in Sagittarius, which is growth. And it says success after a setback. Now, Leo, this is giving me all new address, who this? New state, who this? New money, who this? Like, this is giving me real new stuff, new me. Who the fuck are you? You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's cool. That's that's the cool energy to have. That that's what you want. But when it comes to love, Leo, I really feel like it's it's just we gon' we ain't gonna stay stuck on the past. Whatever happened, it happened. We can't go back. We can't change it. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. I don't wish no malice, no ill will to you. But if you can't love me where I'm at or how I want to be loved, then let me go. Cause I ain't got no problem staying in the course full head and full speed ahead at that. But Leo, that's actually really beautiful. I think you guys are coming as out as like Miss Independent, you know, Mr. And Mrs. Independent type shit. You know what I mean? Where it's you stepping out like you were being unapologetic yourself. However many versions of that that is, however many colors that is, however many layers that is. You know what I'm saying? You're exploring it and then you'll be able to tap in and bring in the authentic version of yourself into the relationship so then it, it's gonna be a relationship specifically tailored to a leo like y'all are the type that y'all just can't have everything everybody else got like it ain't gonna work it don't make sense it don't make logic it don't make sense that shit's not gonna work okay so i would really like for you to consider leo really taking this time out to just expand on you unapologetically you your money your finances your mind your body your spirit all that because then the true essence of the individual person comes out and then it, it, you attract what you are. And again, you want a love. You deserve. Fuck that. You deserve a love specially tailored for a Leo. I don't even know why people decide they want to fucking message me after. All fucking day, nobody responds to me at all. Fucking phone won't shut the fuck up. On the floor. Anyway, Leo, um, please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. I really hope this helped you because, like, like I said, you guys are deserving of a relationship that is specifically tailored to y'all. Like, even all, even though I'm doing a collective for Leos, it's still, <laughs> it's still all y'all that still want a relationship that's specifically tailored to y'all. So I get it. Y'all are such divas, uh, divos, davas, divas, duh, irritations. Is all I'm going to say. Extra. Drama. Theatrical. The most. But I love you guys. And I really feel like... Hmm, and this is just me spilling a little tea. So, Leo, let me know down in the comments below if this is true. Some of y'all actually going to be moving and that's where you're going to meet your love. Hmm. Hmm. Let me know in the comments down below if I'm right or not. Uh, that was me giving y'all some tea, okay, from Spirit. Let me know down in the comments if I'm right or not. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.